Hey everybody, it's Matt with the Easy Life, uh, and I'm here to show y'all my new truck. It's a 1997 Dodge Ram 2500. It's pretty beat up, and I will uh, give y'all the story about it after we do a quick walk around. It's got 17-inch uh, rims. They're factory rims, but I think they're off a later truck because I don't believe 17-inch rims were available with this body or this model year. Uh, now the, uh, the paint is covered in, oh, what do they call it? Flex seal, white flex seal. The guy whose ex-wife I bought it from, he's in jail, uh, was talk, telling me about how her husband is basically, her ex-husband is basically an idiot. So let's take a quick look here at the inside. He tried to customize this thing. This is all made of wood. Uh, now, he did do this. This was a good idea. Uh, it's got a manual transmission. As you can tell, the shift knob is a screwdriver handle, which was weird. Uh, right now, the ignition key doesn't exist. <laughs> uh, there's a story behind that, I'll tell you. The radio doesn't really work. I mean, it comes on, but it doesn't really work. Uh, it had a custom stereo in it. Center console is not bolted down, so please excuse that. But uh, the headliner, they replaced it with burlap because it was sagging. They had, I need to replace these or recover them or something, the sun visors. Uh, but yeah, the, all the stereo wiring down there. The steering wheel's hacked up a little bit. The cruise control buttons are missing. But uh, it does run. It does run. Uh, let me pop the hood here. We'll take a look at the uh, at the engine. The mirrors are busted out. Now, like I said, I'll tell you all the... And the windshield's busted out. I'll tell you all the story here in just a minute. Uh, it's got a nice light bar on the front. It does work. got the 360 cubic inch 5.9 liter v8 gas engine uh when the lady i bought it from told me about it, i was hoping she'd be mistaken it had a v10 in it but hey uh, i can do a lot with this engine uh it needs a little bit of work obviously the truck was originally white this is this is the original paint so the truck was white to begin with grill was chrome but let me show you <laughs> the original horn doesn't work uh, the guy I guess it broke and he didn't know how to fix it so instead it's got this horn yeah <laughs> uh, the, it does not lock the locks busted out over there too but let me tell you the story behind this. What happened was basically the ex-wife who I bought it from. Oh, by the way, this bumper is a hack job. It's loose, as you can tell. Uh, she found out the guy was cheating on her. Uh, he's in jail now, like I said, for various reasons. But she busted out these tail lights. She busted out the mirrors, like we talked about before. And the passenger window, it does not have a passenger window. Uh, the part that covers the steering column and the windshield. And uh, I've got parts on the way for it. The headlights are still in good shape, although the driver's side marker needs to be replaced. That's not from her, that's just... That happened. It's got some dents and dings in it, which I'm going to fix. But I only paid $1,300 for it. It runs like a dream. It's got a throaty exhaust on it. So there you have it. That's my 